There has been a breakthrough in PCOS treatment. And in this video, I'm gonna tell you what it is and also explain to you why your doctors probably never heard of it and therefore never recommended it to you. I'm Dr. Ken Berry, a family physician. Let's talk about PCOS and this new treatment that's gonna help you reverse it and help you feel better than you felt in years. Now, the way doctors hear about new therapeutics is that they read about it in one of their journals. It's advertised in there, or the drug rep comes and explains it to them and tells them how awesome it is and how awesome it's gonna be for you. The reason that your doctor hasn't heard about this new therapy is because it's not a pill. It's not an injection. It's not FDA approved. It's not gonna be pushed by any of the drug reps. Your doctor's never heard of it. And this is a low carbohydrate ketogenic diet. Now wait, now wait, don't click off yet. I'm not joking. There's actually lots of credible research that supports a very, very low carbohydrate way of eating for PCOS. And the reason that it helps so much is because when you have PCOS, you're basically fighting against three things. You're fighting against hormone imbalances, you're fighting against advanced glycation end products or just glycation in general. And you're fighting against inappropriate chronic inflammation. There is copious amounts of research showing that a very, very low carbohydrate whole food diet, a ketogenic diet, a ketovore diet, a carnivore diet, helps with all three of these things. Indeed, there's been much research done about a ketogenic diet specifically for people suffering from PCOS. A recent systematic review and meta-analysis in frontiers and medic in endocrinology showed without doubt that a ketogenic diet is the best diet to help not only the root causes of your PCOS, but also to help drastically improve the symptoms of your PCOS and also to help improve your fertility, your ability to get pregnant, if that's something you're interested in. This research builds on the research. Uh, another study was published also in Frontiers in Endocrinology back in 2019 that showed that without doubt, a vegetarian diet, a plant-based diet, a vegan diet is the worst diet that you can eat if you suffer from PCOS. So if your healthcare provider has recommended to you, a PCOS sufferer, that you should eat plant-based or vegan, they are not only going directly against the research, uh, it's probably borderline malpractice. Most women suffering from PCOS think that they have a testosterone problem or a DHEA problem, but the problem, the problem hormone that you may have never heard of before is your insulin. The vast majority of women suffering from PCOS have a condition called hyperinsulinemia. And when this hormone is at inappropriately high levels, it causes all your other hormones to get out of whack as well. And so stop focusing so much on kind of the endpoint hormones, testosterone, DHEA, progesterone, estrogen. Start focusing on the root cause hormone, which is insulin. And indeed a ketogenic diet is gonna return your hyperinsulinemia to low normal quicker than any other diet you can eat. Also quicker than any pill that you can take, including glucophage or metformin. If you're sick of your PCOS and all the symptoms that come with it, if you're sick of taking the medications that help a little bit, but never help a lot of bit, and you kind of like some vegetables in your diet, then check out my Keto 101 playlist. If you just be happy eating meat and eggs, then check out my Carnivore 101 playlist. Either one of these is going to help you reduce the inflammation, reduce your insulin back to low normal, and reduce the glycation all of these together are giving you your PCOS symptoms. This is Dr. Berry. I'll see you next time.